Also developing tonight, a decorated Chicago area soldier killed in a sneak attack at his own base in Afghanistan. CBS 2's Tara Molina is in the control room with an outpour of tributes for the Purple Heart decorated soldier. Tara. Brad Nerica, Michael, Michael Isaiah Nance is described as a leader with a great sense of humor who looked forward to having children. His uncle, Kenan Forrest, spoke out on behalf of his family today. Tonight, Michael Isaiah Nance's uncle sharing his love and fond memories. Brilliant young man, really enjoyed his life, was really looking forward to being in the Army. It's like a lifelong dream of his. And he was just grateful to be able to serve his country. Quote, it was an honor to serve beside you and be a leader in the same environment as you. How friend and comrade Tyler Carlton, currently overseas, describes Nance. The decorated member of the military joined in 2017 and won several awards, including the Purple Heart, the Bronze Star Medal, and more. Another comrade sharing tonight. You made me laugh so many times. I'm going to miss you, brother. I remember you told me before you left that you were so excited to become a daddy. They're not the only ones reeling tonight. The Chicago area native is one of two soldiers killed in Afghanistan Monday, where U.S. officials say an Afghan soldier shot and killed both men. The Department of Defense tells us both men were parachute infantry, assigned to the Army's 82nd Airborne Division, based in Fort Bragg, North Carolina. Their division memorializing the two in a post online. Quote, the expertise of every staff member of this brigade and in the 82nd Airborne Division will be utilized to ensure the families of the fallen are taken care of. As we move forward together, I ask for your thoughts and prayers for the families affected and for the paratroopers of their unit who are still deployed. Now, a Pentagon spokesperson tells us this incident is still under investigation. 15 U.S. service members have been killed in Afghanistan this year. Reporting live in the control room tonight, I'm Tara Molina, CBS 2 News. Brad and Erica. Tara, thank you.